What's up guys, I'm Brian, I'm an addict, and today I want to talk about enabling. I want to tell you how my mom enabled me. My mom enabled me by letting me sit on the couch every single day, by letting me live in her place rent free, by overlooking me and my crimes and my addiction, by allowing me to live comfortably. You know, they would say, oh, he doesn't have that much, he just has a bedroom, he has no money. Yo, I was in paradise. I can get high here. You got some free cheese in the uh, refrigerator. You got some free water. You got some free soda. You're going to give me $5 gas and pay for my car. You're going to pay for my cell phone bill. And I am going to live a mental crazy life in the room over while you're living your normal life. I am going to destroy myself in my bedroom. Like that's how my mom enabled me by just saying, well, at least he's still alive. At least I know where he is, man. The best day of my life is when they finally came to me and they said, dude, you are out. You are hitting the streets. That's how I got sober, man. They kicked me to the curb and I was like, uh, it's too cold and I'm afraid to be homeless. I can't believe that my family is not gonna let me do this anymore. You're gonna kick me out? How could you do that to me? How could you get out? We've had enough, man. Like, they enabled me for a long time, and when they stopped, I stopped. And I don't know if that story's the same for every single person. I'm just here to give you guys my experience, man. If someone in your family is using, do not enable them, man. Don't give them the cash to pay their cell phone bill. Don't pay for their car payment. All you could do is love them. Love them and pass on information of recovery. The best day of my life is when no one indirectly helped me live my horrible life and made it any easier for me. When it was completely impossible for me to be the addict that I wanted and needed to be, I stopped. When I realized that I didn't want to be homeless and my sister wouldn't let me sleep on her couch anymore and I wasn't welcome at my other sisters and my brother was smart enough to protect himself from me because he didn't want me around his kids, that's when I got better, when I had no choice. I hit my bottom and my bottom was homeless. My bottom was no one's going to finance this thing anymore. No one's going to give me money anymore. No one's going to let me eat free food anymore. And I ended up in a rehab and I said, I have no choice but to get sober. And my life has been amazing ever since. Do not enable people to get high. It is very dangerous. And that is a hole that has no bottom. The longer you enable, the longer you leave them at a standstill. You enable your 15-year-old son and you're going to be trapped with a 55-year-old son. My name is Brian. Thanks for letting me share. Subscribe to my channel. How hard are you willing to work to change your life? Welcome to SoberTube.